Ladies and gentlemen, Bobby Reacts back with another Call of Duty Mobile Reaction video. Lots of new stuff, it looks like, is going to be coming for Season 3 of Call of Duty Mobile. We got guns, we got rank stuff, we got maps, we got all the good stuff. Hopefully it's as good as it looks like it is going to be. I'm super, super excited for a lot of this. Uh, I won't take too long on the intro. We'll go ahead and hop into it. But before I do that, you guys have to like and subscribe. Otherwise, I'm going to get mad at you. Also, some of you probably aren't aware of this. This is not the Bobby Plays channel. This is Bobby Reacts. This is a separate channel. So if you want to hit the subscribe button because you've been watching the videos all along and didn't even realize it was a separate channel, there you go. But anyways, we're going to go ahead and hop into the stuff. So this is the one that I'm without a doubt the most excited about. New rank icons in Kodem China. You can see this is just a completely different system than we have right now because currently the top rank goes up to 6,500. You can see right here, 8,000 points for the top rank. And it's actually seven ranks instead of six ranks, which is what we have right now. So right now we have Rookie, Veteran, Elite, Pro, Master, Legendary. This is a completely different system. And I actually have somebody who's translated all of them for me. So uh, shout out to Subash right here. Updated ranks in COD M China. 1 to 1,000 bronze, silver, gold, platinum, diamond, master, god of war. So I'm hoping that this is all going to be implemented. And based on the fact that for the most part, even though in different versions there are some differences in like skins, battle royale stuff, etc., etc., for the most part, it's all been the same in regards to ranked, primarily just for the purpose of COD M champs, and that's the system that they use to determine what the top teams are going to be. So they t tend to keep those the same across all versions of the game. If I had to guess, we'll probably see this in Season 3 of Call of Duty Mobile. And we might have something, I would love to see something, number one, obviously ranked needs an, a complete overhaul. Like, this isn't a long-term solution. It's going to help the game a little bit because it's going to keep the top players playing for longer, which is going to make it more difficult for bad players to rank up. And overall, it's just going to extend the rank season and make it so that people are playing longer. Obviously, those top players are probably still going to reach the God of War rank. If it's the same rank season as we have right now, they're probably going to reach it in like two to three days max. Um, so there are definitely more changes that we need to see. But as far as an initial start, I am very, very excited for this one. Uh, I've been asking for rank changes for a long time, and we haven't seen any since the game launched. So uh, it's definitely about dang time. Next up, we've got some of the rewards for Kodem China. Don't expect to see these in the global version. The Chinese rewards are always different from Global and Garena, unfortunately. Uh, this is actually a super sick skin, so I would have loved to get that. Obviously, that's the Battle Royale. That's going to be the multiplayer. Honestly, this one's a little bit not, I'm not going to say underwhelming, but it's not as good as last season's rank rewards for Cod M China. So, kind of take with that what you will. After that, we do have the new map coming. Uh, actually, it is narrated by a new character, I believe. I don't want it to be that loud. I believe this is Coastal. That's the name of the map. And there is actually an accidental leak. Of the coastal playlist in the game, not the actual ability to play it, but like a fake no event or whatever. What but anyway, uh, new map coming to the game, and then last but definitely not least, we do have the new gun, the PP19 Bison. A lot of people saying this could potentially be the Bullfrog. I feel pretty confident that it is not uh, the Bullfrog just based on the design of the Bullfrog. You can see for, for most of the default builds for the Bullfrog, it's set up a little bit differently, so definitely a, a pretty significantly different stock. That's the stock that you tend to see on the base PP-19 Bison, which is why I think that this is the Modern Warfare version and not the Cold War, Cold War version. But regardless, definitely an interesting gun. The, the For those of you who don't know, the Bison typically has like a 50-round mag, and not crazy high damage, so I don't see this being a meta weapon, but also we've had guns that were implemented into Call of Duty Mobile very differently from their usual versions in past games, so this could very well end up being a meta SMG. I'm not predicting that it will be. I know a lot of people are asking for an LMG to be introduced into the game. We know that the Bruin has been in the game's... Not the Bruin. The, uh... The Dredge has been in the game's files for a long time. I would love to see the Bruin added into the game. An LMG that's actually viable in Battle Royale I think would be really fun to use. And uh, could potentially be a solution to the fact that 
the only gun anybody ever uses in Battle Royale is the AK-47. But that's going to be it for the video. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, make sure to drop a like down below. Subscribe to the squad if you haven't already. And we'll see you guys in the next one.